I'm Stormwatch meteorologist Alyssa Carsley with a look at your web weather. We have another rainy day today, so yes, of course you're going to need your umbrella. Do you have a flash flood watch for our eastern counties up until 8 p.m. today? So if you're Nicholas, in Nicholas, Fayette, Raleigh, Wyoming, or McDowell counties, you are under a flash flood watch up until 8 p.m. tonight. Now this little red box in Kentucky, just north of Pineville, near Phelps, that's a flash flood advisory. That means any storms that move through that area and into McDowell or Wyoming County are producing very heavy rain, and we'll continue to see that advisory into around seven or uh, eight o'clock this morning and any storms that move through could produce some flooding in some localized areas. Now future cast showing we're starting off a little wet as we head into the seven o'clock hour and as we head throughout the rest of the morning more showers moving in as we head into the later morning then in hitting the afternoon between two and four o'clock that's where we're gonna see the most chance for more thunderstorms making it's making their way through especially some of these thunderstorms could become severe with the chance of some flooding throughout the area and that's why we're in that flood uh, that flood watch up until 8 p.m. tonight and then as we head into the overnight hours into late Friday night into early Saturday morning we just have a little bit of scattered showers moving throughout so most of the heavy rain has moved out we'll just deal with some light to moderate rain throughout the overnight hours now hitting going into early Saturday morning some rain still hanging around. We'll see more rain moving in as we head into later Saturday afternoon. So no, you will not need a you will still need your umbrella for tomorrow. You can't put that away just yet because more rain is expected on the way as we head throughout Saturday afternoon. And none of it will clear out until we head into early Sunday morning, right around 12:40 a.m. We'll deal with a little bit of a cloud co cloud cover throughout the morning on Sunday. Now, overall, for the next couple of days, we'll see the high pressure move back in, and that will allow the sun to return as we head into next week. Future cash showing rainfall totals from to right now into early Sunday morning right around seven o'clock a.m. Lewisburg two and a half inches the red areas are between two and a half to around four inches so again we could see some localized flooding with the heavier thunderstorms are more severe, possibly strong thunderstorms making their way through. Now, Oak Hill about less than a half, an inch and a half, and Beckley just a, a little over an inch and a half. So it's really dependent on where you are and where these thunderstorms do hit that you could see a little bit more rain making its way through. Now, weekend outlook for right now, still need that umbrella for tomorrow. 40% chance of some lingering showers that will keep throughout the afternoon tomorrow. Temperatures gain down to 69 degrees. So back in the 60s for tomorrow, very cool start to our weekend. Last time we were back in the 60s, was in early June and we'll continue with a slight warm up back into the 70s as we head into Sunday again another cool day sun returning as we head into Sunday so a beautiful day on Sunday more rain for tomorrow and as for today overall 90% chance of thunderstorms temperatures back down to the lower low to mid 70s 74 or er, 75 in Beckley and 74 in Oak Hill and like I said tomorrow a very cool day back down to the lower 60s for us now tonight overall much cooler than where we where we started off this morning. 60 in Beckley and uh, 59 in Mount Hope. 80% chance of showers and thunderstorms throughout the overnight hours. So you could hear a couple rumbles or thunder or two throughout the overnight and the rain continuing out into tomorrow. Temperatures again back down to the 60s tomorrow. So a very cool day for our Saturday. Then Sunday, another cool but sunny day as the sun returns as we head into the beginning of next week. And the sun will continue all the way out into Wednesday. That slight chance of rain returning into our forecast as we head into into Thursday, temperatures will slowly make their way back up into the upper 70s for Monday, then hitting average again as we head into Tuesday through Thursday.